Welcome to Have a Bible Question Live, where you'll receive a Bible answer to your Bible question. And now, let's study the Bible. We're sitting around as preachers. We're talking. We're going to discuss Bible. And in doing so, one of the things that we want to happen, not staged, but authentically, authentically, um, organically, is that sometimes we we differ. And if you look at religious history, there's always a difference. Is that going to happen from time to time? Absolutely. I'm surprised you didn't say their names. You, you've been see, speaking of things we talk about off the air. There's two names that keep coming up in conversations with with Guyton. You, you know why? Because I'm teaching a course on religious history. I'm reading about them a ton right now. But it emphasizes your point. Right. It's two people who who are, are very much concerned about the scriptures, focusing on the scriptures, trying to get, come to a good understanding of God's will. And yet there's a little bit of different in, in understanding there. Being Luther and Zwingli in the Reformation movement. Mm-hmm. 15 points is, is what they narrowed down to. That 14 of the 15 they agreed, but there was one issue that they disagreed about uh, and it huh. really had to do with the lord's supper and transubstantiation and, and haven't we talked about transubstantiation on the program don't we have just a barely of- not much i think we've touched on it while we were talking about something else uh, yeah it, it, well we'll do was, that again tonight. A side step. Let's, yeah. yeah let's just keep going past it i guess <laughs> but um what was interesting is that they actually had representatives come together realize they were the same on 14 issues but it was on that one issue when they realized they differ Zwingli and Luther both came together trying to seek an understanding. 